What is up, swimmers and swimmers? I just concluded my brother's wedding weekend. He got married yesterday, hence the makeshift studio. But even that cannot stop me from talking about swimming because good Lord, we need to discuss the crazy first day of the 2023 Asian Games. This was of course highlighted by Wang Shun's 154.62 200 meter IM. You heard that right. He is now the number three performer of all time. Dude went faster than Leon Marchand. I didn't even know that was allowed. This broke Wang Shun's own Asian record from the 2021 Olympic Games where he won a gold medal. Remember, Wang Shun got 11th at the World Championships in this event just a couple months ago, going 157.97, and everyone thought he was washed. But the 29-year-old Olympic champion had different ideas. He not only won the event by three seconds, but afterwards he was quoted as saying, Saying to everyone who said I was done, are you done now? Wang Shun swam a magnificently split race, taking it out in 24-5, followed by 28-8, 33-5, and then bringing it home in a 27-6. So a very balanced swim. And once again, he's now two tenths faster than Leon Marchand's world championship winning time. This is setting up a great battle in the 200 IM at Leon Marchand's home Olympics in Paris next year. But the craziness did didn't even stop there. Han Zan Lee won the 100 free in 46.97, becoming the fifth fastest performer of all time and just one tenth off of David Popovich's world record. The craziest part about this swim? Afterwards, Han Zan Lee wasn't even happy about it. He was disappointed because he was shooting for that world record. There is speculation as to whether he will lead off the 400 free relay or mixed 400 free relay later in the meet to try to get that world record time, which I've got my fingers crossed because who doesn't want to see a world record? In this swim, Panzan Lee showed significantly more speed than he had in his previous swims. He was out 22-4 and then back in 24-5. While in his other swims, he had been back a little quicker, the speed obviously paid off. And we're not done. We had three Asian records as 19-year-old Tang Kim Ting went 29.92 in the 50 meter breaststroke. That was a prelim swim. She won the 50 breast in 29.96, just slightly off of her prelim time. So 29.92 stands as the new Asian record. Three Asian records, one finals. I feel like this is very similar to world championships where day one was just completely bonkers. And then we had a couple mellow days. Uh, by the time this video comes out, I may have been proven dead wrong, which I'm hoping for because I want Asian games to be just five days of totally sick swims. But I'm guessing we won't see three Asian records on day two. Prove me wrong, Asia. I was really excited to wake up and see those swims on this Sunday morning. And I think this sets the tone very well for the rest of the competition. And just as a bonus, in case you missed it, Shaban Howie split 51-9 in the foreigner free relay where Hong Kong won bronze. So be looking for her to drop some jaws later in the meet. Hopefully I'll be back with more video updates, but until then stay tuned on Swim Swam for full coverage of these 2023 Asian games. Thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you next time.